for five bucks. Oh, boy! Hey, what's the big idea? This seating is full. Business. <laughs> Hiya, chum. Glad to know you. Glad to hey, know you. Up? I can tell by the way you're ogling this dining emporium that you are a woodpecker who enjoys packing away the groceries. <laughs> am I right or am I right? <laughs> the answer is D. I am always right. Yeah. Oh, and uh, because you are a culinarian of the highest order. I am about to introduce to you a revolutionary new device. It will give you free chow for life. May I present, tum ta ta tum, the fabulous food box by Scamco. <gasps> it's a shipping crate. Oh, it may look like an ordinary shipping crate, but can an ordinary crate turn any object into delicious food? Okay, prove it. No problem. How's about a fresh glass of water made from, say, uh, this old nail? One fresh glass of water, old oh, fabulous food box. Old oh, glass of water coming up. There's probably water in that pipe. Ah, 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 ah. No sneak previewing. Wow! Ooh. Ooh. Wow! Wow! Oh, well, I'll check on your water. Yeah, quick, Twiggy. Make like a cork and plug that leak. How many boxes you want, sport? Not so fast. Let me see you turn this hubcap into a large pizza. Oh, you want your boy, you don't. One super deluxe pizza pie on the double. Oh, fabulous food box. Pizza's ready! So, you're gonna buy the box now, Woodpecker? <laughs> sure, sure. <laughs> After dessert. Hey, make me an ice cream cone from, uh, this rock. Ow! One ice cream cone, oh fabulous food box. We're recalling the rocky road, but you can have this rock. Look, you crazy woodpecker. You only get inside the box after you pay. <laughs> wow! Rocky Road, my favorite. <laughs> I love this box. <laughs> and I love your dough. My very own fabulous food box. I'll never be hungry again. One grilled cheese sandwich, please. Extra greasy. Hmm, must be ready. That's the worst grilled cheese sandwich I ever had. Hey, what's the big idea? So that's it. They were scamming me with food from the buffet. The second seating is about to begin. Hey, Bob, we gotta talk. Hmm? Hmm? Whoa! Hey, boss, isn't that the sucker we just suck at a lot? <laughs> but that's impossible! I, uh, think we might have sold you a defecative food box there, sport. 
Oh, yeah. We might need to recall this model for ourselves and such. He a me for, uh... Retooling purposes, that is. Whoa! Uh, let me take a quick look see inside. Whoa! Oh, 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 boss! It's working! Food! Oh, food! Food! It's really making food, Twiggy. We gotta take this box in for some serious service and sport. It's gonna cost ya. Oh, uh, here's your 50 bucks back. You want me to give up free food for life for a lousy 50? No way! Fine, fine, take everything I got. Just give me the box. <laughs> Just thinking about all that food's making me stronger, boss. It seems lighter already. We just made the find of a lifetime! Woohoo! Ten, fifteen, twenty. That should cover the food they stole from you. And here's an extra five for my ticket to the buffet. No, 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 no. This one is on the house, Woody. <gasps> of the upcoming hockey season rests in the hands of one world-famous super scout. Slapshot's Medley, who has never failed to discover the newest hockey sensation, headed off to frigid Antarctica today in search of new talent that fans hope will rejuvenate the troubled sport. World famous hockey scout, Slapshot Smedley, and I just love discovering new hockey players. Yep, you get me a boy with raw talent, and I'll train him to be tomorrow's hockey superstar today. Well, I'll be. Here I come all the way to the frigid Antarctic to find a hot new prospect, and he goes and finds me. You're some skater, boy, but you gotta learn how to use a door. I've never seen a hot prospect yet who can resist Slapshot Smedley's special signing bonus. <laughs> So fast, small fry. You're the property of the International World Hockey League, and I show now. So listen up. My reputation's on the line. And before I auction your hockey services off to the highest bidder, I want to make sure we smooth off all your rough edges, if you catch my drift. He may be fast, but he ain't the sharpest blade on the ice. First thing you need to do is test your speed and maneuverability. Let's see how fast you can skate around all those little old hockey sticks. Young hot shots come and go, but the stopwatch never lies. Now what is he? On the other hand, speed can be a tad overrated. You new prospects are all alike. You want the fame and the big money and the trading card with your picture on it, but you don't want to work for it. Well, Slapshot Smedley knows how to deal with the likes of you. Now this here drill is to test your face-off skills. Super Scout Slapshot Smedley is about to learn you one big-time hockey move. 
That's how the seasoned pros do it. Go on, son. Don't be intimidated just because you saw the best in the business do it first. Give it your best shot. You gotta build the new one's confidence a smidge at first. Now I know why they called a face off. This boy sure better bring in the crowds, cause something tells me he's gonna cost us a fortune in sticks. Okay, little fella, time to find out about your goaltending skills with a little help from the latest technology in hockey scout. You're supposed to bat him out of the way. Oh, let me show you. Fire that puck chucker up, boy. It's all in the rest action. Oh, sure. I had to find the only hockey player in the world who's more interested in sticks than money. Son, something tells me you're gonna be a natural for a barbecue endorsement. But you gotta play some hockey first. I know just how to tame this pesky little prima donna. Say there, boy. How's about we work on your body checking skills? I'm gonna check this boy so hard his whole family's gonna feel it. That'll get his mind in this game for certain. season sure could use a new player if the sport is to be saved. Let's just hope that Slapshot Smedley can come up with one. That does it. I've had it with you, you no-talent, unathletic supporter, you. I'm through with today's prima donna athletes. I'm going back to scouting girls high school volleyball. Stay away from me forever, Penguin. Oh, too bad. For the first time in his legendary career, Slapshot Smedley has failed to discover a new hockey sensation. And so, I'm afraid, this entire season is being canceled due to lack of interest, folks. But in its place, we bring you the world's best-loved campfire songs. Lover, I'm here to tell you about Colonel Pop's Sweet Corn Chunk Sweepstakes. Here's your game piece, and good luck. Oh, boy. I won! Woody Woodpecker, you've just won your very own farm. Imagine it. Here, swamp, mud pies. Say, Bob, I want a sweepstakes and I'm taking over the Colonel Pop's corn farm. Do you know where it is? You city folk are funny. <laughs> Seems you got all turned around. Colonel Pop's corn farm is, uh... uh -huh. Why, the farm is, uh... 
right here. You've arrived. <laughs> uh, excuse me, just a country sec. I'm the new farm caretaker. <laughs> Gabby Gator. Whoa. your farm, son. This is a swamp. Right, uh, swamp farm. <laughs> Look, Bob, I won myself a farm with all the trimmings. So, where's my tire swing? Uh, isn't that it over there? Where? Oh, oh, oh. silly me, my mistake, it's over here. And where's my corn? <laughs> where's my... Oh, you city folk. This isn't swamp corn season. Well, then where's the corn grub, Bob? Oh, yes! Come right up. Now you just enjoy yourself, son. <laughs> Coming right up. I'll teach this gear never to mess with a woodpecker again, much less try to eat one. <laughs> <laughs> Swing, Gabby. I want corn fritters, Gabby. Let me drive a tractor, Gator. Oh, I'll tell you, it's no good when dinner bosses you around. farm up the way. <laughs> Excuse the fashion show here. I I've been waiting for the Colonel Pops contest winner to arrive, but some dumb gator's been causing me a whole heap of trouble. I you haven't seen him, have you? Hey, I'm the contest winner. <laughs> and there's your dumb gator. <laughs> Come here, you corn napping varmint. <laughs> Come here, you ain't just in this for nothing. I'll get bit by Kay right now. Mm. Ah, nothing like a good old-fashioned live 
Country Show. <laughs>